Hello, so in this video I'm going to talk you through how to set up a LinkedIn company page and then I'm also going to use some tips about what you can do to make your company page more effective. So first off we're going to log into LinkedIn onto your personal profile. Next up here in the top right you have something that says work. Click on that and then this option will open on the right hand side. At the very bottom there's an option that says create a company page. Obviously we're going to click on that. Next up we're going to select which of these is applicable. As you typed in you want to create a company page you're probably going to want to create a company so press company there now you're going to go out and fill out the information that's relevant to you so we're going to say this is test company and then we can have a, a specific url so this is if someone types in that url they'll be taken to your company page it may not be available but put in whatever you want to make it bespoke to you then you would add in additional information so we want to put in our uh, existing website industry this just helps people find you and also it's used in the back end for things like sales navigator for other people to search for your for your company industry also it shows at the very top of the company page so someone can get a feel as to what it is you do uh, what industry you operate in so it's worth filling out so we'll say we work in manufacturing here if you can pick a, a, a drop down that's fantastic uh, and then we're going to put in here tech growth marketing if i can spell dot uh, com next up organization size uh, again it's just to uh, signify to people what size your company is and then organization type we are a uh, private company privately held next up you'd upload your logo so whatever that may be just click here it'll bring up a pop-up window press select and then the tagline is another section that shows at the very top so it shows up here which summarizes what it is you do for this I'm going to give you a structure that you ideally want to follow when filling out this tagline. You want to say we help X and the X is whoever your target audience is. Achieve Y and that is the outcome of your service and then in brackets you want to put without and then something they hate doing. So for us we help SaaS and tech companies and tech companies accelerate their rate of growth. within 45 days and then within brackets without having to figure out oh we're running out of characters so we'd have to play around with that to make sure it fits but follow that that structure we help target audience achieve result you can put within time period as well if you want to be more um, more punchy with it and then in brackets if you have the space without something they hate doing that they're currently doing that's the most efficient way to convey to someone um, what it is you guys do so we're going to click verify cool so now our company page has been created now at the top here we have a, um, a list of steps and obviously we want to get this all the way to the end that is just putting in everything we can to flesh out the company page and make sure it's um it's finished and ready to be viewed. So what we want to do is we want to go through and make sure we fill out as much as we can on the page because that's going to help people who visit our page to determine whether you know we're a good fit for them. Do they then want to go on to our website and, and potentially get in contact with us? So the way we're going to do that is you have some suggestions at the top here and you could just click on those and, and it'll allow you to, to do that task or down here you have edit page as an option. You can just press on edit page and you just work your way through so on the left here we have all the different sections and we want to make sure that everything is actioned so if there's the opportunity to upload a logo or a backdrop we want to click it and upload that um, if you have a field that can be filled out make sure you fill it out um, but yeah work your way down this list and fill out as much information as you can it's really self-explanatory there are some features that are relatively new that people aren't really using that much which I'll talk through right now and then I'm going to show you a finished profile we're going to use Canva as an example because they're a fantastic example so um, this option collect leads on your page uses a LinkedIn uh, lead form to be able to collect people's information on your page to use this all you need to do is press on um, and then you can select what the call to action is so let's say for us it's uh, request a free demo you need to put in a privacy policy URL um, if you're running any lead form it's just a requirement just link the privacy policy you have on your website then you're going to put in a very brief headline so request your demo of our software today 
and then uh, a, a bit of copy. By the end of this demo, you will know how to blah, 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 blah. That's what it's going to look like on your page. You can then save that. Um, and basically, it will pop up a little lead form and people just need to press like one button. It will be auto filled. And that means that you can get leads a little bit quicker. Um, so yeah, work your way down, fill out all that information. Once you've done that, there's a few things you can do on the page to get the page going to get, give it a bit of traction. To begin with, you can invite connections. So if you press on this button here, invite connections, it'll bring up a list of your existing connections and you can select who you think is relevant and then you can press invite. If you press invite, they'll get a little notification and that notification um, will uh, be sent to them, inviting them to follow your company page. You get 100 credits every month and they reset every month. If someone declines, then you get that credit back. Um, the reason you want to do this is just to get some numbers in your company page to begin with. So we're going to set that up. Additionally, we can do a post. So we can write a post. This is my first post. Uh, and we can post that. So here, post. That then posts to our company page here. Now down here, what we can do is we can click these three dots and we can press pin to top. I would strongly recommend when you set up a company page, do this when you first set, set it up. You should have ideally a video. If like if you have a company video, you should 100% be using that. Or you can have a single image. And you want to create a post that's about what it is you do. So we do X, Y, Z. This is our core offer. And your video can explain that or the image can showcase it. Um, and basically, you want to have that at the top of your feed and you want to pin it. The reason you want to do that, and I'm going to go over to Canva as an example now. Um, they haven't got a pinned post, but essentially what would happen is you would have the post that you pinned would always stay at the top. So even if you posted it a year ago, it would be at the top. And then all your most recent content would be just below that in sequence. So the reason you want to do that is when someone comes onto your page and views the post, they get the most valuable and useful piece of content you want to show them at the top of their feed. So that's that's why you would do that. But in terms of a company page, this is what the finished uh, article is going to look like. Um, and that's everything. That's how you set up a company page. Now, what I'd recommend is once you set up your company page, um, you look into uh, potentially running adverts. So you can do this on anyone's company page. You press on posts and then ads. Company pages enable you to run adverts. Um, and that's one of the most useful functions of a company page. Organically, for the most part, company pages don't perform very well. Personal pages outperform them, but you should have a company page regardless. If you want to use LinkedIn as a method of generating leads, ads is the way you should go if you want something scalable and fast. Um, I have a completely separate video, the ultimate LinkedIn ads guide, which I'll link below this. If you want to check that out, you can do. But yeah, that's how to set up a LinkedIn company page. Hope this video has helped. If you have any specific questions around the process or anything else, um, please just comment below and I will get back to you. Cheers.